Hey, what's up guys? It's Friendly Manuel here and in this video today, I'll be sharing with you guys 10 must-have apps for online marketers. Yes, so if you are an online marketer, you know, um, there are some apps that you might basically want to have on your phone, right, to actually help you assess your work easier. Yeah, we know that most times we are more mobile than even on our laptops or the desktop, right? And this basically means that it will be much easier for you to do your work if you have, you know, um, some version of your desktop app in the mobile phone, right? So quickly, guys, I'll be walking you through the 10 mobile apps that I use as an online marketer and you can also pick them too. Right, so without further ado, I will jump into the list of the 10 apps. But before then, guys, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel right now, and hit the bell icon so you do not miss any of my videos. Right, so quickly, guys, listing out the 10 apps. The first on the list is WhatsApp. Yeah, WhatsApp. So WhatsApp is actually a cool messaging, you know, platform. And you know, one cool thing is it's on the mobile phone. In as much as you know, um, it also has this desktop version. But I feel it's a mobile application, right? Yeah. So um, WhatsApp basically you can use to connect to your colleagues. You can use to connect to you know your leads and you know chat up with you know people and also you know send out tasks to your teammates and you know a whole lot more stuff you can do via WhatsApp. I'm sure most of you are familiar with WhatsApp. At the same time, you can also you know drive sales through WhatsApp and close leads via the platform, right? So it's a cool one for you if you're looking for an application on your mobile phone that can easily help you, you know, reach out to maybe your team or your colleagues or you know um, your 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 leads, right? You can go ahead and use WhatsApp on your mobile phone, right? So it's available for either um, Android and iOS too, right? So the second app here today is Buffer. Right, so yeah, Buffer is a social media scheduling tool, and yes, it's more of like a desktop app, but it also has a mobile version. And basically, what this mobile app does is to help you schedule your social media content, right? Yeah, so um, it's more of like you know, um, help you to upload your content. For example, on Instagram, you have content you want to upload on Instagram, and you may not really have the time to keep on pushing you know content every day to your Instagram account. You can go ahead and schedule this content via Buffer and manage everything from your phone, right? So that's another cool one for the second. And the third tool that I use as an online marketer is Zoom. Yeah, so um, Zoom is more of like a video conferencing app. And basically, you can use this app for your online meetings and you know, um, for your webinars and different things online, right? And I actually love this app due to the fact that it has a mobile app too, right? So with the mobile app, you can easily connect to your meetings with your leads or your team, right? And you know, um, join in in you know, whatever conversation they're having via video, right? So it's cool with using your phone to do it in as much as, yes, it's a desktop app, but with your phone, you can easily connect and you know, um, go ahead with your daily activities as an online marketer. So the fourth mobile app I use as an online marketer is Canva. Yeah, so um, Canva is basically a design tool, right? And it's one that you can use on your phone. So it's a simple design tool in the sense that you as a beginner online marketer, most times we do not really have this full knowledge of you know, designs, right? Yeah, there are actually some other super technical tools like Photoshop and you know, um, some others that you know, people use to get their design up. But Canva is an easier version, right? And it's way better because it's on the mobile phone. So you can just you know, unlock your phone, go open the app on Canva, and you can make simple designs that you can use for your marketing. So the fifth app I use as an online marketer is Trello. And Trello is a list management app and what it basically does here is just to help me to, you know, um, balance my, my work life, right? Yeah, and the basic thing I actually do with this app is, okay, for example, my YouTube channel, I actually use it to, you know, um, upload the list of content ideas I have in my head and it helps me to check which is done, which has been scripted and which, you know, is left undone. Right, so um, you can actually see the tabs on Trello where you can move work to you know um, just started or finished or about to be um, executed. Right, so this is one cool thing I love about Trello. In as much as it is not as feature rich as its you know counterpart Asana, but it still serves me and you know it gives me what I want as a, a management application on my mobile phone. Okay, so the sixth mobile app that I use as an online marketer is called Pocket, right? So I would say Pocket is just like a pocket, right? And why I say this is basically because it is more of like an app that helps you 
you know, to save content that you actually want to read later from the internet. So you're actually trying to make some research and you see some content that, you know, um, you are very much interested in, but you cannot be able to read it now because of your time, right? And most times, coming back to those contents, you might have wiped off your browser and you can't get them. So um, Pocket actually helps you to save, you know, um, those blogs, those uh, articles. So when it saves them, you can actually go back at any time and using your mobile app Pocket, you can get to read this content over and over again. The next tool that I use is called Sketch. And Sketch is basically, should I say, it helps me to mark my images, right? Yeah, so most times you actually have images, maybe screenshots from the internet, and you want to send it over to somebody and you're looking for a way to add some markings or add some pointers or even add text on top of those images, right? So um, Sketch basically allows me, you know, to add these different options on those images and more like highlight, you know, different parts or different segments of, you know, um, the image that I want to send out. Maybe I want to send down to my team, right, to, you know, pay note to some certain aspect of a particular piece of um, content I have. Right, I can use Sketch to basically highlight them or add markings with arrows and different other tools for your highlight. All right, so the seventh app I use for my mobile phone is Facebook Pages Manager. Yeah, so as a social media manager and you're more of like handling different brands as an online marketer, right, it actually comes to a time where you know um, you wouldn't want to really keep on logging on to your desktop to be able to see you know the different you know, engagements that you have on the different pages you have right and it's actually way better if you can open up your mobile phone right wherever you are and check up the engagement you have on different pages that you you know manage right so this helps you you can reply to people you can actually you know like you can you know um, send them requests and all through this particular um, application and since it's facebook you can also link it up to your instagram account right so by doing this you can also manage your instagram dm and also you know um um, reply or you know um, answer to different engagements you'll be having or different messages you'll be having via your Instagram DM and also your pages too right so this is another cool mobile app I use so the eighth tool I use as an online marketer having my phone is Google Docs Google Sheets right yeah so um, Google Docs basically is an alternative to Microsoft Word and if you're really a fan of Microsoft Word, you know that you have to open up a desktop and, you know, keep on typing in Microsoft Word and, you know, um, should I say that's where it ends? All as much as, yes, I know that there's more of like a mobile version of Microsoft Word, but um, Google Docs is more of like, you know, um, a cloud-based um, document storage application, right? So you get to put up your documents and it is saved in the cloud and it also gives you a link and with this link you can share to anybody around the world and this person can have access to that content you've written right so this is one thing i love you know google docs and the major thing here is you know you can also use a mobile app to make your edits and put up your content and you know um share this um content you have to different people using your google docs link so since it's very phone it's also one of the applications that i you know mostly use via my mobile phone the ninth application I use via my mobile app is called Voxa. Yeah, and um, you know, people actually you know, see Voxa as more like a walkie talkie, right? It's an application that you can use to communicate with your team via you know, voice notes and all. But personally, I use Voxa you know, to keep recordings of my ideas, right? So I might just wake up and I have this idea to build so and so thing, right? So what I basically do is I open up my Voxa app and I talk into the application and it more of like stores my recording. And I actually would prefer this app to the recorder in the phone, basically because you know, um, I can actually, you know, assess all of my um, recordings from my idea or my business all in one place, right? I can actually group these recordings into different segments and get back and understand, you know, each and every, you know, aspect or category where I've placed my recordings in, right? So it's a great tool if you wouldn't want to use it just as a walkie-talkie like it is made for, right? I just use it as a recorder to keep all of my ideas and also, you know, um, you know, um, jot down things, like pen down things, right? So the last app here that I'll be sharing with you guys is called Dropbox. So Dropbox is actually a cloud drive, right? So it actually gives you this access to um, storage in the cloud. You can get to store your files, your folders, 
your application and all up in the cloud, right? Most especially your documents. So it's basically for we online marketers, most times we handle a whole lot of documents, a whole lot of files, right? And you wouldn't want, especially if it's a client file, you don't want it to get missing or, you know, you will start looking for where to dig it up from. Right, so Dropbox basically helps you to store all of these things in the cloud. And it's so cool that you can access your Dropbox account via your mobile app, right? And you know, you get to store folders via your phone or you know, store up documents via your mobile. Yes, so guys, these are the 10 mobile apps that I use as an online marketer, and it has really saved me a whole lot of stress and saved my day so many times, right? And I would really suggest you pick up one or two and you can get to start using. If there are any of these apps that you're using already, you can go ahead and you know drop them down in the comment section below so that you get to know which apps you're using currently. And you know, go ahead and leave this video a like and make sure to subscribe to this channel and hit the bell icon so you do not miss any of my videos. So with this, I will see you in my next video. Peace.